while our last couple of guests were really outgoing and very friendly and they just come right up to you, um, Sarabi is a little bit different. She's probably the most nervous dog that we have on the floor in terms of going into new places, meeting new people, things like that. Um, Sarabi is about a year old. She is a beautiful blue fawn mastiff mix. Um, and that's why I really wanted to promote her today. Even though she, you can definitely tell that she's nervous, she's going to be much happier in a home environment. So anything we can do to get her into a home sooner rather than later would be, would be great for her. Um, we do have her on um, some supplements for the stress of being in the shelter to hopefully ease that up for her. Um, and she is starting to get more comfortable back in the kennel where she spends most of her time. This is a super new place for her. Um, so she's starting to kind of uh, settle in, um, even though we've moved her to a couple different kennels. Um, she's great with the kennel staff. She's very affectionate with them. Um, she takes treats pretty nicely. Um, but she's still definitely just trying to kind of get the lay of the land in this um, stressful and, and kind of strange environment. Um, but, uh, you know, she has a lot of potential. She is a large dog. She might actually weigh the most of any dog on the floor right now at uh, 77 pounds. Um, smaller, however, uh, than her brother who has already been adopted. Um, she came in with uh, Mufasa. He weighed in at like 111 pounds. So he is a big guy. Um, so she could definitely fill out a little bit more as she's only a year old. Um, but because she's so nervous, we are looking for a family with uh, no small kids. We don't want to startle her. Um, we don't want her to react in fear in a way that might be less than positive. Um, as sometimes people uh, expect more from our dogs than maybe what they're capable of, especially when they're feeling quite nervous. Um, but if you have a nice quiet household and um, the time to commit to letting Sarabi kind of uh, become, um, to feel safe and, and relaxed in, in a new home environment, then I think she's going to be a great pet for somebody. So you, you noted that Sarabi's nervous around new people, but with other dogs, it's a different story, correct? Yeah, so she came in with another dog, so she, she felt comfortable with with Mufasa and um, on her kennel there are all kinds of notes about what other dogs she's making friends with um, you know our kennel staff has been um, you know as uh, we get into winter we have you know less animals in certain areas so we have a little bit more time to spend they've been parallel walking them so she's been making friends with some of the dogs in the kennel surrounding her because they walk about the same time um, and we did note in her behavior assessment that, you know, walking through the kennel and stuff, she reacted favorably to all of the other dogs. So maybe having another dog in the household would be something that can help boost her confidence, make her feel a little bit more secure as she's warming up to, to her new human family. Um, if you have that nice, quiet household, that is going to be uh, a place where Sarabi can kind of uh, blossom and come into her own, um, then going to visit fcac.as.me is going to be the first step to making that happen. <laughs>